All right, now I'm going to go ahead and do this video because I'm being harassed really, really fucking bad after releasing that video that I just did in the middle of the fucking night. And I was trying to get some spiritual help, but to make a long story short, I ended up um, losing my full on baby consciousness and having it altered. And the purpose of that is, is so that I can never get my timelines back and does my blessings. With that being said, you know, I mean, you know, I woke up in the middle of the night and it, I'm just going to go ahead and just spit it out and say it like this. You know, I feel like, and I sense the realm in which I'm stuck in. It seems like I'm stuck in. I know it sounds crazy. Um, Ethan Ocala's consciousness. And to make a long story short, You know, it's like this fucking guy with hair around his head and he wears glasses, you know, and it's like a dome that I'm stuck in in the astral plane. With that being said, um, this guy here, the bike. Put an entity attachment that's designed to um, basically possessed me and take me over. And that's exactly what happened. And um, I got taken over almost by this really, really evil entity. Um, the guy's a Freemason who lives out there in Malibu. He's a biker. You know, with that being said, you know, they're trying to deprive me of and take away the last bit of my consciousness. And I really, really need help. You know, I earnestly need help. I'm not going to lie. All right, now I'm going to go ahead and do this video because I'm being harassed really, really fucking bad after releasing that video that I just did in the middle of the fucking night. I was trying to get some spiritual help, but to make a long story short, I ended up um, losing my full on baby consciousness and having it altered. And the purpose of that is, is so that I can never get my timelines back and does my blessings. With that being said, you know, I mean, you know, I woke up in the middle of the night and it, I'm just going to go ahead and just spit it out and say it like this. You know, I feel like, and I sense the realm in which I'm stuck in, it seems like I'm stuck in. I know it sounds crazy. Um, Ethan Ocala's consciousness. And to make a long story short, You know, it's like this fucking guy with hair around his head and he wears glasses, you know, and it's like a dome that I'm stuck in in the astral plane. With that being said, um, this guy here, the bike. Put an entity attachment that's designed to um, basically possessed me and take me over. And that's exactly what happened. And um, I got taken over almost by this really, really evil entity. Um, the guy's a Freemason who lives out there in Malibu. He's a biker. You know, with that being said, you know, they're trying to deprive me of and take away the last bit of my consciousness. And I really, really need help. You know, I earnestly need help. I'm not going to lie. I also wanted to mention, too, that it seems like these three evil people here, Ethan Ocala, Nini Ocala, and um, <sighs> Mickey Addison, he's like a 71-year-old Native American. He looks like the third picture, but a lot older. They have control of my consciousness somehow. Um, I know that sounds crazy, and it's a long story, but 
just I'm really, really tired of dealing with this shit. You know, with that being said, um, I, you know, it's like I, I feel like, you know, just consciousness wise in the astral plane, I'm stuck in a realm where I get free of these things. The next thing I know, they keep coming and keep coming and keep coming. And, you know, the only I wanted to mention too that they're linked to those those two people that you see. I also want to mention that as well, those first two people in the uh, picture. Um, I know I sound really fucking bad now, and I sound bad, really schizo, but they link to those two people in the picture. And <laughs> you know, they're threatening me right now by trying to take away my consciousness and all of that and control what I say and control what I think. and. It's, it's really fucking bad. You know, that's why I just decided to do videos where I just spit everything out. With that being said, they, um, I sound really fucking bad, you know. I don't sound together at all. I wish I would have started doing videos like this in the past and I would have been in a much better place. With that being said, it's like I'm stuck in the hell realm where in the astral plane with these people where I'm just constantly attacked and constantly attacked and constantly attacked and I don't know where I am at. I don't know what the fuck is going on and you know, I really need a lot of spiritual help. I also want to mention, too, that in the astral plane, it appears it seems that my consciousness is under some type of, like, in the astral plane, we'll have buildings or different things on our astral map attached to our consciousness. And I have, from what I saw, MK Ultra and all sorts of, like, Illuminati government, government buildings over me. So with that being said, I'm just going to earnestly say, please pray for me. Please pray, pray for my spirit guides and higher selves because I'm going through something right now in the spirit plane where I'm being totally disconnected, totally disconnected by very, very evil people and entities and forces so I can be controlled. With that being said, please pray for me.